California getting hit hard again with another atmospheric river dumping rain across the state, a state of emergency now declared by the governor. The governor was clear in his directive to take every available action to keep Californians safe during these storms. Dangerous flooding and high winds along the coast are a major concern with gusts up to 70 miles per hour expected. That could cause downed trees and power lines. This comes just a few days after the Bay Area saw its second wettest day on record. Heavy rains slamming businesses and homes, stranding hundreds of people in their vehicles, killing at least one person. At least two levees failed in Sacramento County. Another storm system also ripping across the country. More than 20 states on alert for heavy snow, ice, flooding, damaging winds, and tornadoes. You could see possible tornado damage in Marion, Alabama, with multiple twisters reported across seven states, including this one caught on surveillance footage outside of Little Rock, Arkansas. Video shows it crossing this football field and hitting a school. South of Louisville, first responders rescuing a person from a flooded pickup truck. Further north, heavy snow from Wisconsin to Utah, where up to 52 inches of snow fell. At Minneapolis St. Paul Airport, a plane skidding off the runway after the Twin Cities received up to two inches of snow an hour. And in Sioux Falls, South Dakota, residents see digging their cars out of feet of snow. The heavy snow part of the system will move into the Rockies as we head into Thursday and Friday. Up to a foot of snow is expected there and avalanche danger will be high. Rena Roy, ABC News, Los Angeles.